Hey guys, Pixie here, and I'm making this video because Chemica Vision asked me to show you guys how far his bell tower shot was. This is the Trinity Church bell tower shot. Now to find the distance of the shot, I'll be making a line from where Chemica Vision would have stood to where the ball would have traveled to the hoop. That's the top of it to here. Now, I do know that the hoop is 101 feet away from the bottom of the bell tower church, which is obviously at a right angle. I also know that the church is 95 feet tall, and I know that the hoop itself is 7.5 feet tall. Now, because I know that the hoop is 101 feet away at all points from the church, and I know that 7.5 feet tall, we can make a new triangle at 7.5 feet tall. Now here's the enlarged drawing of the triangle that is formed when you draw a line from the hoop's rim right here to the church when it's exactly parallel. Now because it's parallel, we know that the distance from it is still 101 feet. Now, because we removed 7.5 feet from the bottom to form this triangle, the church's height now is 87 feet and a half feet. It's not the actual height of course, it's only the height of this triangle. Now, because we have two legs right here, and we know that the church is exactly parallel, we can form a right angle which allows us to use the Pythagorean Theorem. The Pythagorean Theorem is A squared plus B squared equals C squared. Now, the A squared and the B squared are the legs of the triangle, so we can insert into the equation now. 101 squared plus 87.5 squared. The x is the hypotenuse and c squared is the hypotenuse. So the final equation becomes 101 squared plus 87.5 squared equals x squared. Alright, so now we're going to go find x. We have to add the 101 squared plus 87.5 squared to get 17,857.25. Now that's not his exact distance obviously. We need to square root it to find his real distance. We'll do square root 17857.25 equals 133.6310218 which we can reduce to approximately 133.6 feet. Now this distance is a little bit longer or shorter because we didn't bring into the fact that the ball arched or Chemical Vision's height because it'd be too much of a variable. So congrats Chemical Vision for making a shot over 130 feet away. Like I said, it's not completely accurate because I didn't include your height and the arch of the ball because it's just too many variables, it'd be too complex. Now here's one more look at your shot. Subscribe to me and Kevin Vision.